is Roderick Mitchell, uh, formerly known as Hot Rod on the football team, number 39. I'm pl I play middle linebacker for Southeastern. Uh, one of my one of my uh, jobs I also play special teams for for our football team. Oh uh, well, after the season, we prepare by we first we rest our bodies for a couple of days, and then we we hit the hit the road running. We start running and lifting weights, preparing, and then we flush out the past. We flush out the past season. We try to build on what the former seniors built on. Because up to this point, uh, you know, this is the first season where we just turned around this fast, like the fastest turnaround Southeastern have had in a long time. And now we're just trying to make our march for other years to come by inspiring other freshmen that are coming in and other transfer students that, that are coming in to buy into the process and put all they put all put all they have into the game. Uh, we 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 just we just work really hard, you know, make a family, a bond, and we can all work together. Uh who, my dad put me in football as a young as a young child because uh, at first my mom had me in choir and he was like I don't want my son to be all singing around in church and everything I'm, so he put me in every contact sport football uh, wrestling boxing and football really stuck with me because it was a brotherhood and you had friends and it wasn't it wasn't a long sport you you had a family bond. And uh, I had different coaches that pushed me to be a, a great player. Uh, and I always had to prove myself because I was always one of the smallest kids on the team. And I always had to work really hard. So it was always a test to myself and my character to, to be the best player or to try to be the best player or to make my name remembered. And by, my mom never thought I would make it to college. And I was like, I'm going to make it to college and I'm going to play college football. So it was a, like I, that even more it, it motivated me even more to play college football. That nobody thought I would make it to college football, and no nobody ever thought I'd play high school football. And defying the odds, never let nobody tell you what you can't do. Uh, I continue to play, and it, it just uh, I just uh, just prove people wrong year after year after year, and it just. That, that motivates me to keep going, to keep fighting on, because if I give up now, you'll always give up. But if you keep fighting through everything, you'll see a, you'll win the prize at the end. So that's what really motivated me to play football.